He says, have mercy on me, O God. According to your steadfast love, according to your abundant mercy, blot out my transgressions. Wash me thoroughly from my iniquity and cleanse me from my sin. For I know my transgressions and my sin is ever before me. You see, David couldn't get it out of his mind. He kept replaying the conversation in his mind. He kept replaying the memory of standing out on that balcony that one fateful night and wishing, wishing over and over, a thousand times over, if he would have just walked away. David kept seeing the shame in Bathsheba's eyes. David kept seeing the gleam in Uriah's eyes as he thought he was serving a king that loved him. David kept hearing the words of Nathan. It's you. It's you, David. God said, I gave you the crown. I gave you the castle. I took you from the pasture to the palace. And if, David, if I could have, if I could have given you more, I would have. He said, was it not enough? What, was it not enough, David? If we take that into our day, right now, you, God says, I've given you Jesus. I've given, you, I've given you my only begotten son. I've, I've given you the Lamb of God. I've given you all that I have. Is it not enough? Is it not enough? What more? What more do you want from God this morning? What more is there than Jesus? Jesus. 